Emmys aren't just about the awards, it's also about the fashion. Hi, I'm Sophie Schlacey with ET Now. With the 66th annual Emmy Award this Monday, we thought it was only fitting to round up some of the best and worst red carpet looks. Lucille Ball is one of our favorite actresses of all time. So oh, this is easier. Yeah, we can handle this, okay? I think we're fighting a losing game. And she has one of our favorite Emmy looks from back in 1968. Between the gown, the boa, and the updo, she was on another level of glam. 1997 was Helen Hunt's year. She took home an Oscar for As Good As It Gets, and in September, she was bringing home an Emmy for Outstanding Lead Actress in Mad About You. You know, it's not enough to buy the glasses. You have to actually put them on. I can wait for the contacts. Thank you very much. Her silver dress by Laurel complimented her gold Emmy like they were made for each other. Heather Locklear's white Richard Tyler gown in 2000 placed her on another level of gorgeous. It seems like January Jones took a page out of Heather's book in 2009. She was dressed to perfection in a white Versace gown. Did Donatella call you herself? No, I called her and asked her if I could wear it when I saw the picture. She's lovely. But with the good comes the bad, and that's exactly what Patricia Heaton's 1999 look was. And remember the mystery dominatrix that same year? Yup, that's China. All we can say is that with that getup, we're hoping she had a wrestling match scheduled after the Emmys. Oh, the Emmys red carpet. Who are you most excited to see when the show airs on Monday? Let us know on Twitter using the hashtag ETEmmys. I'm Sophie Shalacy for ET Now, and be sure to keep it locked on ET Online for all your latest award show updates.